Good day, everyone. Hope you are all doing great. Uh, welcome to our club today. Uh, today we have a meeting of the uh, beginner intermediate presentation with our key member Nahla. She is going to present us some topic which is really important for all of us. That is self confidence. Due to real important change happen to her own personal life. Nehla would like to share with us some key points uh, that helped her to have a better self-confidence. Uh, for now, please keep your devices on mute. Uh, at discussion time, raise your hands for participating and I will unmute you so you will take part in the discussion. Hope you are going to enhance and enjoy your English today with us. Thank you very much for your coming. And now we go to Nahla. The stage is all yours. Okay. Uh, thanks, Ms. Dina. Hi, everyone. This is Nahla. Today, I would like to talk about uh, an important subject. It's called self-confidence. Before I start, I would like to tell you about the reason why I chose this topic. Many years ago, I didn't have confidence in myself, maybe because my family always surrounded me with fear of everything and prevent me to do what I love. And that made me lose many opportunities in my life. But one day, I insisted on achieving my goals and I didn't allow anyone to get in my way. I believed in my abilities and I believed that I can achieve my target. My goals started coming true from building my own business and from learning English. Learning English introduced me to meet new people and learn a new thing. And now I will start with my topic. Okay. What does confidence mean? Self-confidence is the belief of a human being in his or her abilities with thoughts and goals in life. Confidence can be a tough thing to build up you should know more about self-confidence and you wish you were a more confident person. You can be that person if you do some practical steps to build your self-confidence. Who is confident person? Unfortunately, not everyone is born with self-confidence. Some people get self-confidence throughout their personal experience, while some other may never develop it. To be confident means, sorry, being confident means doing what a person believes is right, even if it's unpopular, willing to, to take risks, admitting his or her mistakes and learning from them. Sorry. Being able to accept a negative compliment without getting upset or having negative attitude. Treating others the way you would like to be treated. Treating others with love, passion, and respect. Loving yourself and be optimistic at all times. How can I enhance my self-confidence? People need to remember that everything takes time and will not happen overnight. Sorry, but uh, yeah, sorry. Uh, people need to remember that everything takes time and will not happen overnight. For example, you cannot go to sleep and expect the next morning you wake up feeling confident. You need to take the time to build your confidence. A self-confident person is a person who loves himself and doesn't like to be hard. Sorry, uh, something happened with me. Just a minute, please. I... Yeah. Yeah, 
sorry, no, I can I I uh, I should uh, repeat. Uh, people need to remember that everything takes time and will not happen overnight. Uh, for example, you cannot go to sleep and expect the next morning you wake up feeling confident. You need to take the time to build your confidence. It's important to believe deep down that you can change. Change doesn't necessarily happen easily or quickly, but it can happen. And uh, here I read an article about self-confidence and I wanted to share some of the important points with you. There are similar things you can do to build your confidence. Some of them are just a small change to your frame of mind. Others you will have to work on for a bit longer to make them familiar habits. Number one, look at what you have already achieved. It's easy to lose confidence if you believe you haven't achieved anything. Make a list of all the things you are proud of in your life, whether it's getting a good mark on an exam or learning to surf. Keep the list close by and add to it whenever you do something you are proud of. When you are low in confidence, pull out the list and use it to remind yourself of all the awesome stuff you have done. Set some goals. Set some goals and take out the steps you need to take to achieve them. They don't have to be big goals. They can even be things like baking a cake or fixing your father's car or drop painting. Just time for some small achievement that you can track off a list to help you gain confidence in your ability to get stuff done. Talk yourself up. You are never going to feel confident if you have negative truth tell you that you are not sorry, negative thoughts tell you that you are not good. Think about your self talk and how that may be affect affecting your self confidence. Treat yourself like you would your best friend and cheer yourself on. Don't listen to the words of others because we know the idea affects action. Overcoming failure. Everyone loses and fails, but who tries to continue and be able to conform the odds is who will succeed in the end. One of the most basic reasons for the lack of self-confidence is our fear of failure. If you think about failure as something that you have to be afraid of, then it will eventually eat you up and will not let you step out of your comfort zone. Start thinking about failure as a means of practice to be better at the things you are trying to achieve. By thinking about failure like this, it becomes a tool for you to help on your journey to succeed rather than something you are afraid of. Don't compare yourself to others. If you want to have a healthy and happy life, then you need to remember the golden principle that, every, that everyone has their own pace to live their life. Some of the common comparisons you can make are you may see your friends getting married. Some of your friends are starting their families. People around you are getting big promotion at work. You should be happy for them. And then move on by focusing on what's going on with your life. If you obsess over what's happening in other people's lives and compare it with yours, then you are found to start thinking negative about yourself, which will bring your self-confidence to zero. Like, sorry, live your life at your own pace and don't compare it with anyone else. Celebrity small accomplishments. 
Did you wake up on time? Got ready in a time? Make sure you treat yourself with a healthy breakfast. Did you get a compliment? A compliment, sorry. Did you get a compliment at work today? Then why don't you go ahead and gift yourself that book you have been meaning to read? Did you finish an ongoing difficult project at home today? Make sure you buy something nice for you, even if it's just small pendants or your favorite food. Remember to always celebrate even the small, smallest accomplishments. This will make you feel better about yourself and you will ultimately start appreciating the work you do and the effort you put into your daily life. Finally, we must trust our abilities to achieve success, to achieve success in our lives. And the most important thing is to trust in God, that he always with us to help us in all matters of life. And teach your children to trust themselves that they build their personality in the future. Okay, now, I hope I present a useful topic through useful information and it will help you to make some change. You can work on it in the future. I put here some questions to can discussion between us. Are you self-confident or do you build your self-confidence? Describe yourself in two words. Because of self-confidence, what did you achieve? An important decision? Learn the new things? or become a better person? Are you good at something, but you think it's not a big deal? Who's your idol? And do you consider the person who has self-confidence as arrogant? Okay, finally, uh, I would like to thank Miss Tina for her effort and thank you all for listening. Thank you, Nehla. That was really insightful and thought-provoking as well. We wonder now, all of us, whether we are indeed self-confident or not, whether we are uh, celebrating small stuff like you said, are, are we comparing ourselves too much with other people, and how does that affect us negatively and positively on both sides? That was a really important topic. Thank you very much. Thank um, you, Nehla. These questions are for discussion. If anyone would like to take part in discussion, please raise your hand to um, have some discussion here. Mm -hmm. So ahead, I'm not sure how to pronounce this name. Okay, we have two. Yes. Go ahead. Adari. Okay, go ahead, Adari. Okay. Uh, uh, hi, everyone. Uh, first of all, I would like uh, to uh, thank Nahle for uh, this amazing topic. Uh, in my opinion, uh, Self-confidence is the most important quality for success in any work and in interesting with uh, other people. Always, um, yani I, uh, I try to build my uh, self-confidence through my education, improve my, uh, myself and my uh, job. Mm -hmm. uh, and I believe in my uh, uh, abilities uh, for uh, uh, for uh, do anything uh, with help my uh, my God. Mm -hmm. Great. Yes. Um, so how do you build your self confidence? Yes, uh, I uh, I build my uh, self confidence. Uh, uh, in my uh, uh, always education, 
improve my self in uh, in uh, yani such such as uh, in my job and i believe in my abilities uh, everything when i do it uh, uh, i believe uh, with the self and the rest with myself interesting yes interesting and it's rest 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 with my belief mm -hmm. that's yeah. really good thank you very much thanks well also we have uh Hosei. go ahead Jose, you can unmute your device and start speaking Hello. Hello. Um, hi, everyone. I am a new student in here. Um, thank you for adding me. Uh, uh, thank you. Uh, first of all, I would like to um, thank you for uh, uh, Ms. Nahla for this uh, presentation. Uh, it's a good idea. It's a good uh, explain. Uh, and I would like uh, to uh, discuss uh, some question with us uh, about uh, are you self-confident? Yes, of course, I have, uh, I, I feel I, I have self-confidence. Uh, mm -hmm. And about uh, building your uh, self-confidence, I think uh, the self-confidence is, uh, uh, is building by, uh, by two important things. Number mm -hmm. one, uh, believe in yourself, especially when you talk uh, yourself about uh, the phrases you can. Uh, so I can. I can do it. I can do this. Mm -hmm. uh, number two, uh, weep on uh, yourself by uh, by some uh, qualifications such as a good education, experience, mm -hmm. and um, don't hesitate. It's uh, it's uh, it's very important. Uh, this phrase. Don't hesitate. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, about uh, describe yourself in two words. Uh, I think uh, it's unfair uh, to uh, uh, to describe myself in two words. Uh, I think I deserve a lot. Uh, <laughs> I am <laughs> I am joking. Uh, I think uh, I am a good man. So, uh, so you deserve yeah. that. You deserve that. Thank you. you thank you. That. Thank you. Uh, because um, uh, all about uh, self. Did you achieve? Uh, by by uses uh, self confidence, mm -hmm. uh, of course I think a lot of uh, uh, achieves, uh, and um, uh, about uh, uh, who is your ideal? Um, my father and any any successful person. Yeah. The world is uh, full of uh, successful person, mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. and about the six. Uh, uh, question. I think it's uh, very important, uh, uh, and uh, it's good, uh, good, uh, good question uh, mm -hmm. because uh, uh, there is uh, because unfortunately some people think the self confidence make them uh, arrogant. It's yeah. wrong. Yeah. We must uh, take advantage to uh, make uh, take advantage of uh, our self confidence to achieve our goals, mm -hmm. not to are uh, arrogant to other. Uh, thank you. Thank you very much, Kusai. That was really interesting. Thanks a lot. Well, also we have Jinan. Um, yeah. Hello, everyone. I'm new here. Welcome. Uh, thank you. Um, uh, the first question is, are you self-confident? How do you build your own self-confidence? Yeah. Yeah, I can say that I'm a little bit confident. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, I've been uh, a long time ago trying to build my confidence. Uh, I, I think that everyone has a chance to make himself confident. It's by maybe if you have a hobby you like or a job to improve yourself step by step. Like uh, if you like English, for instance, you can read a lot. You can communicate with others a lot so that you can make your English better. So if you have uh, like a hobby, like swimming, sport, or etc., so you have to uh, make your uh, goal. It's to be better. So when you become better, 
you will feel uh, good about yourself. So uh, it's uh, describe yourself in two words. Um, I'm kind of ambitious person. Yeah, I like uh, make myself better in uh, a good way. You know, uh, it's uh, just uh, it's a thing. Uh, what is it? Describe yourself in two words. Uh, because of self confidence what do you what did you achieve uh, actually i uh, the road is long for me it's just the beginning uh, i started writing uh, writing to express myself it's a good way to express yourself and make you uh, a good confidence person uh, an important decision okay uh, if you make an important decision if you're li in your life and uh, you think it is the right thing to do, that will make you <laughs> self-confidence. Learning, learning a new thing, yeah. Um, actually, I'm trying to learn multiple languages. Yeah, learn a new thing. Uh, it's uh, actually my passion is in uh, languages. So I'm every time I'm trying to learn a new thing by learning a new language. Yeah. I'm trying to become a, a better person. I think. It, uh, everyone has uh, some hobbies or something that he's good at. So uh, it's my advice to everyone. If you want to become uh, a confidential person, you uh, improve yourself by uh, just don't care to anyone saying or making fun or whatever they do. It's just uh, believe in yourself. Mm -hmm. Just believe in yourself and you'll become a very confidential person. Okay. Are you good at something, but you think it's not a big deal? Yeah, yeah, actually, I do. Um, it's uh, in fashion. I like fashion. I uh, I used to design a lot of fashion. Everyone <laughs> were making fun of me. I thought that one day I'll become a fashion designer. Uh, who's your idol? Um, actually, um, I don't have a specific person, mm -hmm. but uh, anyone who is successful will become my idol yeah mm -hmm. yeah do you consider the person who have self confidence is arrogant no actually some people are arrogant when you become very confident of yourself and don't care for other people when they are giving you a uh, good compliments mm -hmm. or bad compliments or uh, when you just don't listen to advices or something that uh, that's what i can consider an arrogant yeah but uh, but if you are confident in in a good way, you know, um, like uh, doing the things you like in a good way, yeah, you are not arrogant. But in the opposite way, if somebody uh, give you an advice or trying to uh, make you a better person and you just don't listen, this is arrogant. Yeah, <laughs> that's it. Thank you very much. So it's really interesting to hear all this, especially Thank you. the language part. This is my favorite part you have to know because I myself as well do always uh, aim to learn as many languages as possible. And somehow, yeah, yeah. <laughs> somehow it does awesome. build self-confidence. I have no idea how it does. <laughs> thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Well, also we have Rian. Go ahead, Rian. Hello, guys. Hello. Thank you for Nahle and for you, Zina. It's as a good presentation and useful. I really uh, find it is useful. Uh, firstly, the self-confidence always comes from the inside, as well as uh, from the family, if they the full responsibility for their son or daughter, uh, son or girl or child. Anyway, from the small age, they will feel they are they have the self confidence mm -hmm. also uh, describe yourself uh, i uh, are you self this yes i am a self confidence i always want to prove my myself to be a good in all things i i have mm -hmm. uh, all, uh, always um, each one wants to be self confidence he should work hard on his on him on himself. Describe yourself in two words. Um, I think 
I am uh, a confident and I am satisfied person. Right. Uh, because of self confidence, what did you achieve an important decision? Yes, I try to hold or register in an English institute. This is an important decision to myself. I think that is good to me. Learn a new thing. I I don't prefer to new uh, to to new uh, to learn a new language, but I want to prefer to learn a new cultures. This is my hobby. Become a better person. Everyone year by year, he will be the best person, and he will get more experience from the previous year. Are you a good at something? You think it's not big deal? Yes, I am good uh, at cooking. What is not big deal to others? How is your? Yeah, that's good. <laughs> my parents is uh, my idol. Right. And do you consider the person who has self? No, of course not, because this is too uh, too uh, different between the conf self confidence and arrogant self confidence. The person who has the ability in for do anything and also for himself. The arrogant uh, person who has a self confidence by don't want to learn anything because he has a lot of so he don't need that mm -hmm. uh, so i think this is uh, the argument person and also he can't uh, he always talking about uh, on himself yeah. and don't want to put any uh, take any advice from anyone so he mm -hmm. he feels that he is the Idol, idol, or the ideal person mm -hmm. in this life. Maybe he's overconfident. Yes, overconfident. Yes. This will make a negative effect on his self in the society. Mm -hmm. Indeed. They will, they will fail in the end. Yes. 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 It will. Probably. Yeah. And thank you. Thank you, Julia. Um, really thank you for your answer. Thank you. Okay, we have also Mariam. Go ahead, Mariam. Uh, hello. Hi. Uh, Hi. First, uh, firstly, I want hello. I I want to thank uh, Nahla about uh, the interesting topic. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Uh, it's a great job, and uh, also also I. Thank you. Well, I also I uh, want to thank the manager. Uh, uh, the subject uh, of self confidence is very important, especially mm -hmm. when it's from uh, childhood, uh, mm -hmm. because when when the child uh, grows up, the self confident he will be able to enter life stronger. Mm -hmm. uh, that's my my opinion. And uh, actually, uh, I will uh, let uh, answer the questions. Um, I can say uh, to first question, yes, uh, often I'm um, self-confident, uh, but uh, what, um, what did I mean by often? Self-confidence is uh, present when there is no fear, uh, no fear uh, of making a mistake uh, or hesitating uh, to make any uh, decision like what uh, Nahla said. Yes. Well, in, in some situation, uh, I can't control myself to be fairest. And uh, uh, what's the second question? Describe um, yourself. Uh, just, just one minute. Uh, no, I. Um, uh, how to? How uh, do you build yourself? How do you build your self confidence? Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, I. Um, 
simply I was built my self confidence from uh, some helpful factors. Uh, the most important is my family. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, and uh, what the second uh, question? Uh, I can't describe myself. Mm, mm, I don't know. Mm, maybe uh, just uh, I. Uh, I'm just simple human, just, it's enough for me. That's enough, uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. Um, uh, the third uh, question, okay. Um, Excuse me, can I say something? Okay. Maryam, uh, you, you should, Maryam, excuse me, you can, you should say, I am important to human. Not I am simple human. <laughs> you can get self confidence. You should say that to, to okay. yourself when okay. you when you stop in front of the, your mirror. Say it, I am important to human. Okay. Mm. Okay. Okay. <laughs> uh, 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 there are many times. Um, uh, some of time. Uh, uh, I necessary to. Uh, say the this sentence but in uh, usually uh, let's uh, say i am a simple human uh, the better to me mm -hmm. okay uh, thank you Nahla. okay uh, the, the third question uh, of course uh, i learned uh, many important things in my life Maybe uh, it, uh, it may uh, not came to my mind now, but it must uh, exist uh, as for the uh, decision. I don't know. Uh, you may uh, be laughing about me now, but I consider, consider uh, my this, uh, discussion uh, tourism practicing the English uh, very important and I am proud of this. Right, we all are. <laughs> okay, uh, what's the uh, fourth uh, question? Oh, okay. Are you good? Okay. Uh, I'm good uh, at uh, drawing, for example, but I, yeah. uh, but I think it's not. Uh, yes, you underestimate this ability of yours, and you should share it with us, I guess. It's a big deal for me, at least. Go on. Okay. <laughs> uh, mm, uh, the, f uh, the fifth, the fifth uh, question. Mm -hmm. My idol, um, I don't uh, know, I don't think uh, I asked myself this question mm -hmm. uh, before. But uh, I can't say my idol is someone re re regained English to my mind. Mm -hmm. Like Zine. Thank you. <laughs> oh, that's too much to handle, but thank you. <laughs> uh, okay. And uh, sixth uh, question. Mm -hmm. um, okay. Um, okay. Um, no, never uh, a person uh, is not cons consulted if he is self-confident. Mm -hmm. uh, vanity have dis descriptions that explain it very well. I, uh, my opinion. I see. Thank you for all. Thank you, Thank you. very much. Thank you very much. For those who don't know, Mariam presented the first topic here in our club, which was about the perfect coffee. And since that day, I'm making a wonderful coffee. You have to watch this video in case you missed it. Well, anyone else with a participation or something? A comment? Maybe Nehle herself would like to say something. Ah, we have Adari. What? Sorry, what? What you say? Sorry. Uh, I was thinking of if you have another comment or something, but we have Adari who wants to participate. 
you are unmuted, you can talk. Adari? Yeah, Adari, you can unmute your device. Yeah, go ahead, you can yeah. talk. Okay, sorry, but uh, I consider the, the first uh, someone Okay, I cannot uh, uh, answer for uh, all the questions because yeah. the, the first one, uh, uh, I would like to, uh, to answer for uh, two, two uh, questions. I, okay. ha I, uh, I am a vicious uh, person. Mm -hmm. uh, for uh, three uh, questions, yes, I achieved one of my uh, goals, especially in my work, and I try to complete uh, yeah, I and they do for others. Mm -hmm. uh, now I feel better because of uh, I have uh, qualification and uh, uh, self confidence. Right. Uh, for uh, for a question, uh, my baron baronist is my uh, role model. Mm -hmm. About the last question, uh, no. Uh, uh, in my opinion, uh, the person, uh, sorry, uh, there is a, a totally difference between the self-confidence person and the ego mm -hmm. or uh, arrogance mm -hmm. because the, uh, uh, I consider self-confidence uh, con uh, is respect and uh, appreciate, appreciate, appreciate for others, not mm -hmm. uh, reduce uh, the value. Right, yes, indeed. I agree okay. with you about this. Uh, okay, uh, thank you. And uh, I would uh, like uh, again, thanks for Nehla for enjoying with us. Uh, welcome, and thank Hattari, you, Mr. And Zina. Thanks for your participation. Thank you. Thank you, all of you. Also, we have uh, Jinan again. Yeah. Go ahead, Jinan. Uh, yeah, I had some. Uh, <laughs> Uh, Self-confidence is one of the most important personal characteristics that mm -hmm. determine the life of the individual and uh, his uh, compatibility with him, herself, and his, her community. In addition to that, it means accepting the capabilities that God grants to the individual mm -hmm. and uh, contentment with them and adapting to them and the ability to face daily condition of all kinds more effectively. Self-confidence adds to the individual a sense of pride and a proud uh, of his skills and competencies. Thank you. Thank you very much. That was, that was really important and useful addition from yeah. Gina. Thanks. Also, we have Hussai again. would like to say something. Go ahead. Hello. Hello. Go ahead. Uh, hello again. I would like um, uh, to say something. Uh, mm -hmm. I think uh, all the participants uh, who uh, who's, uh, who who participate in this uh, program, uh, mm -hmm. uh, all especially speakers, uh, mm -hmm. they have self confidence. So mm -hmm. uh, congratulations for all the participants uh, who. Thanks for your participation. Thank you too. Okay. Yes, it's it's uh, يعني, it's in a right way uh, to uh, to build the, the self confidence. Exactly. Yes, everyone uh, here is a brave because they just unmute their uh, speakers and start talking in English, which is not our native language. That do that does indeed require a good amount of self confidence. Indeed. Yes. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Can I say something, Miss Tina? Sure. Uh, it's your uh, <laughs> Thank you. Uh, uh, finally, uh, uh, I would uh, I would like to say something. If you want something, you must insist on achieving it, mm -hmm. and make sure that you will succeed in achieving it. That is the secret of your self confidence. Indeed, to build, to build self confidence. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, I uh, would like to thank Ms. Dina uh, for uh, your efforts 
uh, and your uh, for your in, uh, try to enhance uh, my uh, my ability or or my uh, my language to improve was, my language. Thank that's you. That's my pleasure. Thank you too for taking part in this and being generous enough to share us your language, your topic and this experience you had personally. I would like also to add a comment here. Um, it's about comparison. I find it maybe the most motivating and discouraging thing uh, regarding self-confidence, especially nowadays we are all the time looking at Facebook and Instagram and see people uh, achieving great things. And then we think that we are, sorry for the word, <laughs> We are losers. We can't do anything. Look at people. They, they do everything, but I'm not. Uh, so this is something I would like to point at, in my humble opinion. Um, showing a lot of achievement from someone uh, doesn't really mean that those are indeed like achievements. But um, taking advantages of these uh, social medias, like, for example, um, for example, for Riyam, she says that she likes cooking, but she thinks it's not a big deal, or she thinks it's a big deal, but some people think it's not a big deal. Uh, so maybe sometimes you will be discouraged because of that opinion of some people. Uh, maybe the social media actually can help you build your self-confidence regarding cooking by uh, establishing your own page where you share your delicious meals and... Uh, let everyone knows how good you are at uh, at what you are doing or stuff. So I'm trying to say shortly that uh, not everything that shines means it's a big achievement. It just that means that the person who is doing something with love and care thinks it's a big achievement and they have a better self-confidence. So you should learn from them rather than compare yourself to them or feeling a bit like envying them or something. That's all. Uh, we can we can uh, we can say uh, live your life at uh, at your own pace exactly. and don't compare it with anyone else. Exactly. Don't compare. Learn. Yes. Yes. We learn, not compare. Exactly. That's right. <laughs> yeah. Well, um, if no one else has something to add, oh, Gina. Go ahead. Uh, I just I'd like to thank you all for adding me to this great meeting. I appreciate your patience and the great topic. Actually, it helps a lot in breaking up the nervousness and making you more confident about your ability in language. So thank you again. Thank you too. Thanks very much. Thank you. Thank you for your participation. Well, uh, I think that's it. Thank you all for coming here. Thanks for Nahla for this important topic. Next week on Sunday, we are having a review about a very nice movie I do recommend you all to watch, which is called Loving Vincent. Uh, we will announce about it on our Facebook and Instagram uh, page. So keep updated there. Take a look uh, at the movie or at least prepare yourself. We're going to talk about movies, so it won't be that serious anyway. And... Again, thanks all for coming. Hope that was useful, helpful, and encouraging to everyone else present his or her on topic someday in our club. Wishing you a great day, and thank you again, and see you.